All right, here's the EFZR with two batteries up here in the top. I had to get those a little bit smaller ones because the big ones wouldn't fit. And there's the one in the lower lower rack and then one down here. Now the only problem I'm thinking is that it's going to be awful close to the ground. But I got about an inch above each battery down here. I might be able to raise it up if I have to. I'm going to go take it out to the uh, curb and see if it'll get over the curb without crashing or grinding. Alright, this is backing up to see if it's going to grind. I don't, it doesn't look like it's going to right now, but let me back this up. There we go. I'll try it. It's awful low. Looks like it might clear, at least on this curve. Whoa. All right, well here's, here's the bike outside. Batteries kind of dwarf the look of the motor. Well, once it gets going, it'll be a lot cooler. But I was thinking about, right down here, I got a lot of space right here, and I might mount a power cord there, a retractable power cord that I can plug into the wall and hook up to batteries, that, or battery chargers that I'll keep on board. So, that's it.